A 500-bed capacity health facility is to be constructed at the 37 military hospital in Accra. The $180 million project, which also includes residential units for staff, will scale up the hospital into a United Nations status for quality health care. The Minister of Defense, Lieutenant General J.H. Smith, today cut the sword for the commencement of the project. Diana Densisua has more. The 37 military hospital was originally constructed in the 1940s to cater for the medical needs of soldiers deployed in combat. The hospital eventually opened its doors to extend healthcare delivery to all. Currently, over 80% of patients who patronize the 37 military hospital are civilians. The hospital also caters for referral cases from other countries in the region. To meet the increasing demand for healthcare services, the previous government entered into an agreement with an Egyptian company, Eurojet De Invest, to finance an expansion of the hospital. The 500-bed facility will include 105 housing units for staff of the hospital, 85 flats and 20 bungalows. The project will be constructed in three phases. The first phase will consist of the design and construction of the units. The second would include upgrading and rehabilitation of 13 medical reception stations in all the military garrisons in the country. The third will consist of a national accident and emergency hospital with specialized departments. The Minister of Defense, Lieutenant General J.H. Smith, who cut the sword for the commencement of the project, said plans are far advanced to upgrade all medical reception stations in the garrisons to district-level hospitals. We are aware that structures alone will not solve all the health delivery problems. There are other challenges such as staffing, training, non-availability of medical logistics, including consumables, among others. All these are being addressed. Feasibility studies are underway for the project to commence in 90 days. It will be completed within a period of four years. The chief executive officer of Eurojet, Dr. Said Diraz, said the company is investing $590 million in the health sector of the country. Our experts are also working with the military hospital technical team to enable Eurojet to supply essential drugs and the consumable for running of all military hospital in country. The company donated an ambulance to the 37 military hospital and two to the Ministry of Health. 